So for any, anybody who's ever done a final drive coming off a 425 Trans in a Caddy Eldorado Olds Toronado GMC Motorhome, man, the, the, the bolts and the two nuts are a bear to get to. So I'm going to show you something. Let's see. That's one of the nuts up there we can see. The bolt. And of course, all wrapped around, you know, there's more. So this is what I did. Anytime I find old sockets, wrenches, whatever, I keep them and I throw them in a drawer because you never know when you got to cut one down or make a wrench or something, right? Yeah. Check this out. Best one I've got yet. Junk Chineseum. So this wrench bent like this. We have a total end to end of four and three quarter, top to bottom of two and three quarter. From here to where the bend is off of this, this is only inch and three quarter long. Check this out. thing works wonders. Fender wrench used to work, but all right. So we're going after the nut up here. This bad boy goes right in. Look at that. Man. You can get swingage, you can crack it loose. If you need leverage, you just put another wrench on. I know y'all have probably done this a lot. Look at that. She's bent perfect. And this is a 14 cheap, which is a little snugger than 9 16 which is what those are. So, do yourself a favor. And if you're going to tackle one of these, unless you got an old school fender wrench or door hinge wrench whatever get you a cheap wrench and bend it man it, it'll make things so much easier you have no idea there you go that's how i do it, it works perfect everyone i've ever done no struggle you're welcome